Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Piotr Tarnawski, Angry Admin, and today I will show you how to install CloudStack on your local computer. What CloudStack is? In simple terms, it's competition for VMware. Uh, it's Apache open source cloud computing platform that lets you deploy and manage cloud infrastructure. It helps manage compute, which is virtual machines, storage, networking, user management, load balancing, and firewalls. Think of it as a tool to create and manage your own cloud infrastructure like AWS or Azure or Google Cloud, but on your own hardware or infrastructure. So let's have a look. I have a Ubuntu machine. Uh, for the local installation, we would need to make sure that machine has at least eight gigabytes of RAM, four CPUs, and 50 gigabytes disk space. So first of all, we need to update our system as usual. So it's easy, sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade minus y. y is to confirm our choices, so we don't need to press y along the way. Okay, and once we have our system up to date, now we are going to install my SQL. So it's easy. By the way, if you will go to my blog, which is angrysysops.com, you will get uh, both comments for Ubuntu or and for CentOS OS. So if you on the CentOS or Red Hat, then you can use my blog to guide you through that installation. All right, I see that the base is installed. So now we are going to install CloudStack. And of course I can't spell. And as you can see the error, unable to locate package for CloudStack Manager Agent, it means that the CloudStack packages are not available in the default Ubuntu repository. Uh, so we need manually add um, the official repository. And do not worry, all the comments I'm using now will be added to my blog post on angrysysops.com. So either you can stop the video and copy the comments, or you can just go to my blog post and get from there. So we add the CloudStack repository. Now we are adding the GPG key. And after this, we have to update package list. All right. And we try to install CloudStack again. And there you are. That is working. Okay. So now 
And uh, once we install our cloud stack and cloud stack agent, now we need to initialize the database. CloudStack has successfully initialized the database and you can check your database configuration in this location. All right, so let's start CloudStack now. Of course, sudo. All right, so now let's check our IP. And as we can see, uh, we have an IP of 172.315.123. So let's have a look if we can open uh, our CloudStack console. And here we go. Now, if you deploy your CloudStack and the website doesn't show up, Give a few moments because it could be database updating. Just give you two or three minutes and try again. You should see this logo with the login options. Now the username is admin and the password is password. Domain, leave it blank for root admin access. Uh, we didn't set this up. Now, once you know how to deploy CloudStack, don't forget to like and subscribe, click on notification bell and click on the link to next video to see how to install KVM.